Hey guys and welcome back to another card review. So today we are looking at a pretty interesting card that might be replacing Call of the Haunted. It's called Phantom Spring of the Dragon Souls. It's a continuous trap card that reads, Activate this card by targeting one monster in your graveyard. Special summon that target in face up defense position. It becomes worm type. This, when this card leaves the field, destroy that target. When that target leaves the field, destroy this card. So you know how all those times where you want to play Call of the Haunted but you didn't want to play it because you just didn't want your monster to get killed, you didn't want to take damage to the chin. Well now, with this card, you can go ahead and play it, and it'll be in defense mode. So, yay, it's in defense mode, so you don't take all that damage. You know? uh, also, another great benefit to this card is that this says, and it says, when that target leaves the field, destroy this card. So, you know, if you tribute it, the card's gone. If you uh, synchro summon it, the card is gone. As long as you don't exceed with it, because technically the monster didn't leave the field, it went to some weird ass void or whatever. So, as long as you don't exceed, the card will just leave the field, which of course will open up a zone, because you know, uh, you don't like them pesky call the haunt, it's just sitting there on the field. I mean, unless you're going to go for a scrap dragon, of course. But, um, it just looks like a better uh, call the haunted, call the haunted 2.0. So, you know, becoming worm, that's kind of like, eh, you know, no one really cares. I mean, most of the time, you shouldn't care about becoming Worm type. For example, in my Yubel deck, activate this, summon Yubel in defense mode, it becomes Worm. Okay? And? As long as Yubel's not a Worm while in the graveyard in my hand for me to uh, summon Doom Shaman, because of course Doom Shaman can only summon Fiend, so as long as, I, as it doesn't permanently change and make Yubel a Worm while on the field or in the graveyard, then. I mean, in the hand or in the graveyard, then I really do not care. <laughs> but, uh, you know, this way, you know, because that was definitely a problem when I had with Call of the Haunted, where, you know, I would have a Call of the Haunted face down, and, you know, I would probably want to play it and, you know, block, but I'd be afraid of my opponent, you know, you know, especially making a 101 main phase 2. So it was like, oh, attack with my level 4 monster? Attack with my level 4 monster. You want to play anything? No, I don't want to activate the Call of Hunted. Why? So I can just go activate Call of Hunted, block your attack, and you make a 1 1 and snatch my ass up? No, thank you. But with this, I can go ahead and activate it, summon something in defense mode, whether it be Doom Shaman, which I believe has a pretty big booty of 2000, so that's not bad, or uh, Yubel, which pretty much doesn't do much because then I'm still with the same problem as summoning it with Call of the Haunted, which is Yubel's effect is not negated. If this summoned it, with, if this summoned the monster and faced the defense mode, position with its effect negated, then, oh yeah, totally replace Call of the Haunted, and, well, no, because then, Doom Shaman, but, you know, but that, you're still having the same problem, so, with Yubel, it's just like, okay, well, now I have this Yubel in defense position, it's a worm now, and its effect's still there, so I still gotta tribute a monster, and if I don't, then, Yubel kills herself, and then I don't get terror, but, uh, you know, going ahead and summoning monster in defense mode, then they go to main phase 2, no 101, no 101, you ain't snatching my ass up anymore, no more 101, so that's good. So, it's just another Call of the Haunted, pretty much exactly like Call of the Haunted. I guess it's supposed to be for the Yang Zing monsters, but it could be pretty much used for anyone as long as you don't mind turning into a worm. So, tell me what you guys think about this card in the comment section below. Um, I said, I think it's just a pretty good card, you know. You can still just treat it just like Call of the Haunted with some of you bell play. So, you know, your opponent wants a blind space, you can go chain, summon, it's destroyed. When this card leaves the field, destroy the target, so you destroy your bell, summon, tear. But you can also just go ahead and go activate this, summon Doom Shaman, use my normal summon for the effect. This summon uh summon a uh, Tinker, Sync for eight. And then is it attached to the monster? I'm not sure if it's attached to the monster. Oh, it just says when that when this card leaves the field when that target leaves the field, destroy this card. Alright. So as soon as you synchro summon with a uh, Doom Shaman, this card will be destroyed so you don't have to you have these cards and stuck in your uh you know, in your zones like pesky uh, you know, Call the Haunted, but still, it's just another Call the Haunted. Call the Haunted 2.0, pretty much. So, I don't mind this card. I don't mind this card. It's not exactly what I needed for my, uh, <laughs> for my, uh, supervised deck, but I totally don't mind it. So, tell me what you guys think about this card in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching another episode of Card Review. Thanks for watching, and, uh, I will see you guys in the next Card Review on Thursday. Thanks for watching.